the conspiratorial thinking that's led many Americans to raise awareness about human trafficking. What? That's what the uh, MSNBC morning show demon had to say today, right? Um, they are seriously mainstream media going on and on about the conspiracy theory of human trafficking. They themselves did shows on it, right? So they talked about it. They're okay with talking about it. They know it exists, right? But they never said children. Now that it's about children, well, you know, it just feels warm and fuzzy to, you know, think about saving children. What? It's happening everywhere. In the 90s, there was a article about the suburban sex slaves in Seattle. Something like 700 of them. And there was like Dateline 2020, all these different shows talking about teenage and children sex slaves. Okay. It's always been out there. Why are they afraid of it now? Because the movie touched on androchrome, touched on uh, he, organ trafficking because it's children. Why? I mean, I know why, but and it means the good guys have won, but how sick, how demonic and how sick so many mainstream medias out there are trying to debunk child sex slaves. Now, the, the movie words it on the different headlines, they say human trafficking, and then they say the sex slave industry. They say child human trafficking. So they separate the words so that you can Society can digest it slowly. I've known about it for decades. Um, I've seen it on the dark web on Facebook, and I've reported it, and they don't care. Um, they have their avenues of how they do it, and um, it's been out there for decades upon decades upon decades. Add that to, you know, the family child molester, and um, sex with children is something that I've known about <laughs> my whole life. I'm 52. And, and, and the trade of it and the organs and the, and the clones and the breeding them for sex. Underground tunnels living in there to be uh, for sex. And did you see the new Guardians of the Galaxy? All those cloned? They're doing disclosure everywhere. Uh, it, it is sick, okay? Those of us who have exposed corruption for a very long time and known a very long time have had to digest the horror of this for many decades. So yeah, it is sick to think that there is child sex slaves and that when they get older, they breed new child sex slaves and that they sell organs. It's sick. It's time to feel it and do something about it. 